Podcast, CP the Tool Addict, coming back at you. We've got a good video, a little bit different today, but it's something, it's not necessarily a review. I just want to talk about um, something that I am also uh, an addict of or whatnot, and that is my Oakley sunglasses. <laughs> uh, I have a pile of them. As you can see, I have... Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen pairs of Oakley sunglasses. Um, now, you're probably thinking to yourself, CP, that is a little bit of aggressive, that is a little aggressive, and there's no way that anybody needs fourteen pairs of sunglasses, and you are 100% right. <laughs> so, uh. We're not going to argue about that. Uh, that's just, uh, that's the long and short of that. But what we are going to talk about is, is what everybody mistakenly sees out of Oakley sunglasses. And that is this right here. Um, pure fashion. Um, these are, these are basically, um, so these are the uh, uh, Dispatch uh, Oakleys. Um, these are kind of cool because the, uh, the sides in here, they pop out here. And then your little side piece pop comes out. You can re replace the side pieces and whatnot in there. Little arm in there moves. Um, they're just they're just not very functional without the uh, polarized lens. They're more for fashion. I actually don't wear these that much because I feel like I look like too big of a um, huge uh, d bag. But nonetheless, they're cool glasses. I bought them. I own them. Um, what what did why do I like Oakleys? Well, first of all, we're going to let me go through all everything I got and then we're going to talk about it. I want to show you guys all my glasses and then we're going to talk about a few key points about them. So these are the dispatches. I showed you the unique feature on them. Uh, these are the gas cans. These are the ones I've had for a long time. These are polarized, mirrored. These are my favorite uh, lens. Um, and I'll talk to you. I'm going to tell you about things that I don't like about them. Things I don't like about these are is that you see how my cheeks hit underneath here. So when it's uh, when I get fogged up, they get they get fogged up easy. So I tend to not like those as much. Then we have the Bat Wolves, um, another favorite designer pair of Oakleys. Once again, these ones don't fog up as bad because they leave a gap right here. So they're nice. Um, then we have right here the um, these are one of my favorite the Hijinks Ducati edition, and these are. You won't even see a lot of these. See if you can see it on there. Where's that? Yeah, it's right there. See if I can get that show up there. Focus. Focus. It says Ducati right along that lens down there in the bottom. And it comes with a custom Ducati red tag bag. So they're not really a collector, but it says Ducati on the bottom of the lens there. Sorry, let me get that right there. Um, not really a collector. It was just kind of a cool thing. And I'm, I'm a Ducati fan. Uh, my buddy owns a Ducati shop in Omaha, so shout out to Omaha Ducati. Um, my buddy Gerald, uh, awesome guy, um, uh, has a great motorcycle shop there. So um, then we're gonna talk about <clears throat> these are my newest one, of, my last newest player. These are main links. Um, really like the main links. These are actually probably some of my favorite pairs. Uh, work really good. Don't get my cheeks caught up high underneath here. Stay fog clear. These are prism and they're polarizers. We're going to talk about the differences in those. So I'm going to try to give you guys a good guide on Oakley buying. If you're thinking about Oakleys or not really a big fan of Oakleys, I'm going to tell you why you should be. Then we're going to go into the uh, these ones right here. Also, my second recent player. These are the Holbrooks. Another favorite pair of glasses of mine. They're awesome. Uh, they do, like I said, once again, they don't get fogged up here. They keep open over here. That's the biggest thing for me is because I got a chubby face. Uh, the fogging up really annoys me. Uh, then we have the uh, style switches, and these are very unique. And I bought these because originally I bought them for shooting. So I could switch out lenses to clear. And see that the bottom opens up and the lens comes out. Pretty cool glasses, guys. Uh, these are multifunctional. So these are also prism lenses and polarized and then they come with just polarized they come with two sets of lenses and you slide it in here lock them back down in there 
and then you push this down and the nose piece locks them in there they're definitely a fantastic option biggest problem is fitment once again um these these hide a little hot ride a little high on my nose right here so uh they're not as comfortable to me and then they come with these lenses here too and a little extra place in your sack for them in your oakley bag Got a little pocket in there for them so uh anyways guys now let's move on to the shooting glasses uh now hopefully i can get through all this because there's a lot of these shooting glasses that are to go through these are the m frame oakley's um these are a uh, prism um radar lenses and these are uh these are a different shade. I forget what these are called. I might, I'm a little bit out of sorts on these on the shooting glasses. These are what most of the military and police use. These are ballistic, made 100% in the USA, ballistic frames. These will literally take a bullet fragment um, and not break. These are some of the toughest glasses. So when I, you guys know I competition shoot, that's exactly why I have Oakley's. Uh, these things, the frames switch out real quick. You can get different lenses for them. These frames are by far the toughest on the market. Um, then we have for my other shooting glasses. These are my ones I use all the time and I'm noticing one problem. These Oakley's are getting orange peel on them, which Oakley warranties that. So hopefully, um, I don't know why it's doing that, but they are definitely orange peeling. So these are called tombstones, Oakley tombstones. And what makes these unique is just like that. The front, the, the frames switch out. And you can put different lenses on these with your frames. Very, very unique. Now, for a guy, these these tombstones are really good glasses because that's about the end of them what I got for Oakley's. The one thing that's really cool about these uh, Oakley glasses are is that you've seen I got two different kinds of prim prisms here. So here's another shade of prisms. If you are a mechanic... What I think is cool about these Oakleys is, is not necessarily these are for shooting, but if you're a golfer or a fisherman, these Oakleys definitely come in handy for that uh, because these prisms help you see in the water. If you get a brown lens, you can really see, but not only that, you can get polarized sunglasses and you have three to four different lenses you can switch out for the tombstones. And you've got glasses. And the best part about it is, is, for me, for a guy like me, for shooting, I don't have a ridge to block my vision if I'm shooting down low or underneath the port or something like that. So it uh, comes in a nice case that holds all of your lenses in them. These are called the Oakley Tombstones. Now, eight minutes into the video, I've showed you all the glasses, so I've showed you a bunch of options. I want to talk to you about a few things right now about uh, Oakley technology and their... Um, why I like Oakley's and what I what what I know about Oakley. So Oakley was designed from a guy who was a photographer who was had a very um, distinct knack for the the um, study of the eye. Uh, you know he was he was very interested in optometry. He was a photo photographer, um, the gentleman that started Oakley, and uh, definitely had a interest in the in the human eye. So the curvature of an Oakley is supposed to be mimicked to the eyeball of a human. So that way it makes the natural view of the eye a little bit better for um, having wearing sunglasses. So they, so they actually line up with your vision better. The other thing is, is the anti-specifications on an Oakley sunglasses, sunglasses are much higher um, than normal sunglasses, which the Spies are actually really good sunglasses too, guys. Don't get me wrong. I have two of them. I have the Helms, and I have the Happy and a Happy Lens uh, Atlases, um, and I love these glasses too. Very good. The Happy Lenses and the and the Spies are very awesome too. Um, these are not Happy Lenses, but these are more style. But I learned that the Happy Lenses. So, anyways, um, just to show the, the those sunglasses. Back to what I'm saying. The Oakley lenses not only have your prisms. Um, anti-specifications, which means that they are higher rated than most of your standard uh, safety glasses. Um, so if anybody tries to tell you that your Oakley sunglasses are not well, uh, they're not they're not better than safety glasses. They are dead wrong. In fact, the M frames 
are one of the highest tested glasses um, in uh, pretty much on the planet. These things are ballistic rated. Not ANSI, ballistic rated. So the military uses these glasses specifically. These are, these are military rated, tested, graded, and approved. Um, now let's talk about polarized, um, prism, what that means. Prism lenses are fairly new. So my lens, these, these ones right here are prism. Um, and they say usually a prism lens says it right there down there in the corner. What a prism lens does is it's designed for different terrain and polarizing. And let me tell you just real fast what it means. If you guys have not seen an Oakley demo, um, I wish I could do this. I wonder if I can do this with the camera. Um, the glare that it knocks off of, see how the camera just kind of, um, I'm putting that lens over the, over the camera. And you see how that just knocks the glare off of everything. It's not a very good representation, but you have to try the Oakleys out for yourself. They have a demo where they do a mirror where you can see through the mirror. Because it cuts the glare off a mirror even. Um, I use them for driving, especially long distance driving. They really do for eye fatigue. These prism and polarized lenses from Oakley really do reduce eye fatigue and, and save your eyes, guys. They... Oakley is an expensive sunglasses, and I know people argue with, you know, it's not worth buying cheap sunglasses, or you might as well just buy cheap sunglasses, but I'm telling you right now, I have bought cheap sunglasses, I've had these glasses, for most of these glasses for over 11 years, never lost a pair of sunglasses, and I'm honestly, and I say that now and I'll lose a pair, but uh, I'm honestly sold, I'm a big fan of Oakley and Spy, for that matter, I'm not against Spy neither, I really like the happy lenses and Spies, they, they are... These are green, and you can see, putting them over the camera, my lenses are a little bit dirty. But uh, you can see how they kind of cut the glare off them too. But anyways, um, prisms, great for, for golfing. Anything you do recreational, it's not just shooting for me. Uh, golfing, baseball, um, fishing. Fishing, you can see down, and it cuts the glare off the top of water. I'm telling you guys, it, the biggest test that I could do for you is take a pair of Oakleys. I wish I could do that. I wish I could do I wonder if this will work. If I could take you guys and show you. Because the biggest thing you can do is look at a, a car. If you, if you look at a car where it's a sunny day and you take that car and you look directly at the windshield, you'll see the light bouncing off the windshield and you can't see through the car you take these sunglasses and you literally look put them on and look through the car let's see if i can i'm actually going to give you a shot here we're going to try this out real quick like we're just going to see if it works let me see if i can switch it around here raise this up sorry my so we're going to see if we can look through here on my truck Yeah, you can. You can kind of tell. See how it cuts the glare off the truck? See how that shines on the window? So, uh, and it's, you know, that's the cool thing about Oakley prisms is they save your eyes. They cut that glare down, reduce struggle, reduce strain. I really believe in them. And uh, I really just want, I, I'm not a, I, once again, not a sponsor. Oakley's not a sponsor. But I've used them for so long. I just believe them, and I actually can tell the difference. So, um, just wanted to uh, address that with you guys and uh, kind of tell you my thoughts on Oakleys and I'll show you all the Oakleys I have and just do a video about it. Because, honestly, Oakleys are awesome. Oakleys are okay. <laughs> so, uh, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Appreciate you. Remember, like, comment, share, subscribe. Ring that bell! <laughs> and remember, keep your hands dirty and your money clean. Thanks for watching.